All right, guys, uh, just gonna quickly answer one of the biggest questions I get on almost every single one of my videos. And that's how do you play the Insurgency Sandstorm ISMC mod or mods in general? It's pretty easy, but I'll give you guys an answer. First thing you wanna do is go to mods and go to mod IO here on the bottom left. This will open up a Steam overlay here and you'll be brought to their site. Now in the top right, you can see I have my account made. Uh, you probably have a login or create account somewhere here. So all you're gonna wanna do is make your account. And once you're done making your account there, you're gonna come back to the main menu and you're gonna go to play. Go to community servers and then search ISMC up right here. Ensure you have modded selected. And if you want, just copy everything I have selected here. It should make a difference, the main one is modded. After you search ISMC, you should get a bunch of servers here, and click anyone that interests you. I play on multiple different servers, so it doesn't really matter. Um, we'll just go the, for the sake of video purposes, 57 Squadron, and hit join. You're going to get an uh, alert like this. You're attempting to join a server that is running mods, which need to be downloaded. And this is the thing. So hit yes. Now you can check that box and get rid of that notification. And you'll see here you'll be getting a uh, download pop-up on the top of your screen. Once these downloads are completed, uh, you'll be able to play on the server, hopefully no problems, and the mod should be working. I will pause the recording here just to show you guys at the end here that yes, this server does work for me and the mods have been successfully installed. It normally is the ISMC mod, which is the biggest download. I think it's around a gig plus, and then you have all the maps on the server. So it can take a bit of time depending on your internet. So guys, we're in the game here, uh, the ISMC mod has successfully been installed, although I already had it installed, but just for the sake of this video, it isn't working correctly. Uh, you'll see everything looks good here, we deploy, we browse, it looks like, yeah, everything on the server is working fine, I don't see any major bugs or anything, so yeah. It's pretty much that simple guys, just follow the steps and it should work for you.